If you've been wondering where to find a great assistant for your online business, this video is for you. I'm Sylvie McCracken from sylviemccracken.com and today I wanna to talk to you about where you can find a great assistant. This is a question that I get a lot. Now, the first thing is a little disclaimer. I want to let you know that this is actually not the most important part of hiring. Now that might seem counterintuitive, but the truth of the matter is where you can really make it or break it is after you hire, but we'll talk about that later. Let's talk about where you can find a great assistant. So one of the first things that you can do is if you have an online business already and you've been communicating with your audience is ask them because there might be someone in your audience who would absolutely love to work with you. So they already know your voice. They know what you're up to. They know what your products and, and programs are. Now you've definitely got to make sure in the application process and the interviewing process that these are not entrepreneurs that want to have their own full fledged business in a very short period of time. But there's a lot of people that love the idea of entrepreneurship, but aren't quite ready to do that themselves and would love to support another entrepreneur. So that is a great place to start. My second favorite place to start and recommend and something that's worked really, really well for me has been asking my colleagues and friends that also have online businesses for referrals because amazing people know other amazing people. Write that down. So after you do all of that, if both of those things don't work for you or you haven't found someone that you absolutely love, only then would I recommend going to sites like Upwork and using recruiting companies. Now, if you go with something like Upwork, I'm sure you've been on there before, upwork.com and similar sites. There is a lot that you're going to have to do as far as weeding through the, you know, not so great people to get to the gems. So you're definitely going to have to have an application process and, you know, a way of weeding these people out. And that's something that we can talk about on a, on a further video. If you're not already subscribed to my newsletter, click the link below and do that now. And we will definitely talk more about this. In the meantime, I'd love to hear from you. What is your best tip for hiring people? Where have you found great people or what's holding you back from hiring an assistant, which you should have done yesterday, dude. All right. Leave me a comment below and I will talk to you next week.